Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another clean with me. Today we are going to be tackling my main living space during nap time. Right now I have all three littles down for a nap and this is after a very busy four day weekend and after multiple birthday parties throughout the month of February. We also have some sickness in my home right now. My oldest was diagnosed with the flu and I am honestly trying to keep it only with him. I hate that he has it, but I really do not want it to spread throughout my house right now. So he is quarantined to his room and I am going to take today to try to refresh this main living space, sanitize everything, and try to keep the germs at bay. If you are new to my channel, then you don't know that I recently just announced that I am pregnant with my sixth baby. And honestly, the morning sickness slash all day sickness this time has kicked my butt. But we are nearing the end of my first trimester as we speak, and I'm starting to feel my energy level start to come back a little bit at a time. So anytime I actually get the energy to tackle cleaning, I am jumping on it right now because right now it's just few and far between. But we are starting in my formal dining space. If you are not new to my channel, then you know that a few months ago, I decorated this room for Christmas slash winter, and I have loved the pretty tablescape. But like I said, throughout the month of February, we had a ton of birthdays, so I had actually put away all of the pretty table decor a few weeks ago to make way for party decorations. But now that the birthdays are over, the pretty table decor can come back, and I am super excited. So we're going to start in here, refresh this room, and then move on to the other areas in my main living space. Good luck's finally on my side She pulls the sheets off of me every night Whispers my name, tells the sun to rise Hey, yeah, she brings me back to life laundry I wanted to take a moment and show you guys like a dirty little secret of mine and that is the current state of my laundry room with me being sick like honestly the laundry has just piled up but I wanted your all's opinions I am thinking of doing a whole video where I make over this room and I'm thinking of stacking my washer and dryer and then putting farmhouse like shelving along the left wall where the dryer currently is I originally wanted to do like a countertop over my washer and dryer with some shelving above, but I'm not sure if I want to do that or stack them just to give me more floor space. Let me know in the comments below what you would do in here. I got all I could ever need. It's like you the main bathroom was a must do for today. I wanted to make sure that I cleaned everything up and gave everything a good sterilization. I am actually using a different mixture for my cleaner today. I read online that hydrogen peroxide kills tons of germs. So I found a recipe where you take water, hydrogen peroxide, and then it called for lemon essential oil, but I just put my thieves essential oil in there instead. And I am sanitizing everything with that. So I'm hoping that this kills all of the germs and gets this bathroom back to being fresh and clean for the rest of the day. I'm going to go 
ahead and use this same sanitizing spray on my blankets, the pillows in my living room, and my couches. After the sickness is gone, I think I'm going to go ahead and wash everything in here. But as for right now, I'm just going to go ahead and give a quick sanitize and spray. That way I'm not doing more work than needs to be done just in case the flu germs have already been spread. But I'm also going to wipe everything down and wipe down all of the PlayStation controllers, the remotes, etc. because these are well used in my house and I'm sure that the flu germs have been put on them. room that I'm going to tackle during this nap time clean with me is going to be my kitchen area. This room really just needed a quick wipe down from lunch time. There was dishes to be done, the island needed cleaned off, etc. I also had a little bit of birthday decorations that I still needed to take down. My daughter was super cute the other day for my birthday and she decorated this kitchen table with a tablecloth. She blew up some balloons. Like she's such a little mom. I love it. But I'm going to go ahead and take the rest of the birthday decor down and put all of the birthdays behind us. But like I said, I am in my first trimester of pregnancy. And at this point, honestly, I was starting to wear down. So I have learned to like listen to my body and not to push myself too hard. Because unfortunately for me, my sickness seems to be hitting more in the evening hours than in the morning. So once my body starts shutting down, I really just need to listen to it. So I'm going to see how much more I can get cleaned and try to finish my to-do list. draw attention to the shirt I am wearing and also to a couple of other shirts that were sent to me by Thread Tank. I love Thread Tank and I have actually shared them before on my channel but their motto is stories that you can wear and I absolutely adore their clothes. I'm going to put a coupon code in my description box below so be sure to check out their website. Pregnancy wins and that is all that I can do for today but I feel like I did a good job of getting the main space reset and sanitized and I feel good about it. I hope that you all enjoyed this video. If you need more cleaning motivation, please be sure to click on these videos right here in the end screen and you can keep on cleaning with me. The next video coming your way is actually going to be a gender prediction using old wives tales, so you don't want to miss it. That video should be posted Tuesday and I will see you all then.